Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we will try to understand intersect operation in SQL. So this intersect means it is the set operation. So intersection, union, uh, minus, all these are the set operations and uh, how we are going to use this intersect. Before that, we will just have a recap of the concept of intersection. So whenever we have two sets, uh, A and B, uh, A and B, uh, if you want to find the intersection, so the symbol used is this, this is the symbol that is used for intersection. A intersection is B is going to give the common elements of both A and B. So the elements which are common in both A and B. So those elements we are going to get as the, uh, as the output of intersection. So the common elements between A and B is 3. So A and B intersection is going to get an output of 3. Okay, so uh, this is this is what we call it as intersection. Now, how this concept is used in SQL? So, is it used? Yes, it is very frequently used. So, for that, we will try to understand the same query that we have covered in our previous class with a little changes. Uh, in the query two, we have identified, we have uh, we have found the solution for this query, and with little changes, we will try to do, uh, execute the same query. So the query is find the names of the departments which are located in Houston and Sugarland. So previous class we have covered Houston. Find the names of the departments where, which is located in Houston. If you haven't watched that video, please watch that video. So we are explaining this concept based upon the assumption that we have already watched that video. So in order to get this, we have written this query uh, uh, up to here we have written. So what the query states is select D name, department name. Uh, where uh, from department comma D location so out of all those tables we have taken only two tables and the aliasing name is D and L uh, D dot D number so D dot D number is equal to L dot D number so if they are equal and D location is equal to Houston with that we are going to get all the departments which are located all the dep department names which are located in Houston but we want to know all the depart department names which are located in Houston and Sugar Sugarland in both Houston and Sugarland the departments we, we want to get the names of those departments which are located in both Houston and Sugarland try to get that point in both Houston and Sugarland so generally what we will do is generally what we do is uh, where D number so the same query we will write and D location is equal to Houston and D location is equal to Sugarland with that we will hope that we will get all the uh, departments which are located in Houston and Sugarland but this is not going to be the case this is not going to be the case so uh, what we have to do so uh, let's try to execute that and we will see uh, what what happens with this uh, query see here so this is the uh, query see here this is the query uh, where department location l dot location is equal to houston and l dot uh, lo d location is equal to sugarland no row selected why why think of it this point is very important okay so just try to uh, go with the cartesian product of uh, d number uh, this table and this table and this is the cartesian product that is obtained after uh, that the, the resultant table that is after, obtained after the cartesian product of department table and department locations table now now what happens what, how this query will get executed is wherever a d number in department is equal to d number in uh, d locations so where it happens this here it happens here it happens here it happens and here it happens and also where here and here and also here and here so these are the cases where d number is equal to d dot d number is equal to d dot l number and the next condition is where l dot d location is equal to houston so for these queries where the d numbers are equal so l dot d number is equal l dot location d location is equal to houston so this case it is okay and so here and l dot d location is equal to sugarland we will never get that see here 
so row by row we are going to execute so for this row this condition is false so just take it out so here uh, here in this row case so this is equal to this is equal to houston and so we are having only one location so this will never happen try to understand this point here we are having only one location houston and uh, on this row it is never going to happen uh, d location is equal to sugar land think of this point okay try to get that point okay so now how to do that so we have we now in the in such cases in such cases we are going to use the concept of intersect so what we have to do first we have to get the uh, set where d location is equal to houston and next we are going to get the set where the do locate d location is equal to sugar land from both of these we are going to find the intersection we are going to find the intersection now let's try to so how the query is written check here so this entire uh, uh, both this combination of these queries so this is the entire query this is the entire query first we have found uh, the details of uh, the details of the departments which are located in houston the departments uh, the uh, the departments which are located in the location houston and next we have using the intersect command intersect operator and next we are writing the query sugarland so this uh, semicolon is here so this entire query is one single query for understanding i have divided it into parts see here d name uh, department location uh, uh, department location is equal to sugarland <coughs> where these d numbers are equal and d locations is equal to sugarland so let's try to do that so the for the for this query what are the uh, what are the departments that we are going to get department names that we are going to get it is so here it is equal d number is equal to d number equal is it equal to houston no is it equal to here also it is equal is it equal to houston no so is it equal to houston yes it is equal to so the department is research okay so for houston research okay and the next one both are equal both are equal so is it equal to houston no again is it equal to houston both are not equal not equal not equal so here both are equal and is it equal to houston yes so the department is headquarters so I, in short i am writing it as hq okay and the next query so this query this query states about d location is equal to sugar land again on this entire table d location is equal to sugar land and d number is equal to d number so this is the case where d location is equal to sugar land d number is equal to d number and uh, d location is equal to sugar land and the department is research again <coughs> research is for this set for this query and next both are equal but it is stafford uh, so both are equal and it is houston so in this set we are having research and in this set we are having research and headquarters now we have to find the intersection so just this logic intersection the common elements of these two sets the common element is research So the uh, which are located in see here if you take this uh, uh, take this uh, what we call it as a table so the ta uh, the uh, see here five and five houston and uh, sugarland and uh, they are the departments are uh, five and five and the department name number is five and the department name is research we have only one department which is located in both the locations houston and sugarland let's try to execute this query and check whether we're going to get the right output or not so i have already executed these queries see here so 
so let's check this uh, should intersect so just copy this and paste this okay okay things are not working uh, let's uh, execute this okay see here uh, the department name is Houston so so it has ignored these uh, rest of the lines and the query has worked so let's uh, okay we will execute it part by part first we'll copy this and uh, uh, next we will intersect intersect again uh, in the last line we will try to give this entire query second query okay so now execute this research so the entire query where uh, for getting the uh, department names which are located in both the locations houston and sugarland so that is the use of intersect okay so hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching